Good afternoon. Today is Tuesday, November 29th, 2022, and I have a review for you of a product that I recently purchased and arrived today. And I'm going to show you the order details of the product. Hopefully you can read that. The product is the Bissell Air 400 Professional Air Purifier with HEPA and or HEPA, I don't know how to pronounce that, and carbon filters. And I ordered this on November 26th was part of the Cyber Monday sale even though it wasn't Monday when I ordered it and I I paid one hundred seventy two dollars and twelve cents uh, for this item now my sweet sister was kind enough to give me a one hundred dollar gift card for my birthday my fifty sixth birthday and I used that card, uh, that $100 gift card, plus an additional $50 gift card, which I have from accumulating Microsoft Office 365 points. And then I paid $31.59 out of my own pocket. So I'm going to talk a little more at the end of the video about the purchase details as far as the gift card and why I am purchasing this item. But th those details are a little more of a personal, um, more my, my own situation, why I purchased this. And I know some of you are not interested in that, and I, I totally understand that. So I want to I wanna first talk about the product. I'm going to unbox it. Uh, this is probably going to be the first of a two-part review because today I'm going to unbox it, set it up, and turn it on. And then, at, again, at the end of the video, talk about why I bought it. And you know, then the second part of the review is going to be after I've tried it in a couple of rooms in my apartment uh, to tell you how effective it is. Uh, now, this item, this Bissell air purifier, the 400, it retails for $360. So, I want to get this in right away that currently on Amazon uh, this product is still on sale so uh, I want to let you know that it is uh, hopefully you can see that So the product retails for $360, so right now it's selling for $172.12. Now if you have Prime, which I have, uh, the delivery is included, which is great. So I got a great deal on it. It was technically, according to the website, 52% uh, off. And uh, uh, again, I ordered on the 26th. Today is Tuesday the 29th, so I received it in four days. It came. I'm not sure if it was delivered by U.S. Mail or or um, or by UPS or by Amazon. I'm not sure, but here is the box. You can see it's a fairly big box. And let's, without further ado, let's open this up. I currently own two air purifiers, a Honeywell and a 3M. Uh, they have been good. 
air purifiers, but they're nothing like the level uh, that this is. They're not as sophisticated and electronically, nor with the filters. So of course, always be careful when opening these boxes. You don't want to damage the product or damage yourself. over on its side. And also I need to say, I need to tell you that um, I don't have any sort of uh, financial interest in the Bissell company nor in Amazon other than as a customer, uh, nor do I have any friends or family that work for Bissell or Amazon and I'm not getting any money for this review nor did I receive a price discount for this review. Just want to state that. Sorry about that. like a user guide and or setup guide. And of course, I always recommend reading the user safety guide before setting up. Although uh, for brevity, I probably will not read the entire thing. However, uh, don't follow me. Make sure you read the entire thing. Also need to let you know I'm not an expert on air purifiers or electronics. I'm simply a amateur consumer. So here see the plastic bag. This air purifier does not come with a remote control. Here's whoops. Here is the power cord back here. Okay, and let's take a look at this. There is the front of the unit. Here is the top. And then here is the, the back. There is a warning sticker. It says, <coughs> excuse me, before using your new Bissell air 400 air purifier you must remove the protective plastic wrap from the filters so let's see if I can figure out how to do that okay, there's the back obviously and it just says you're just I was just able to pull up a little and gently pull back. And I was able to take the back off. And then here is 
one filter. carbon filter and one is the HEPA filter and it does say uh, top front so let's that and some of these high-tech and low-tech air purifiers, you're able to wash the filters, uh, which is nice. Uh, with this unit, you are not able to wash the filters. It does say that on the top. Obviously, if one is able to wash the filters, that is a cost savings. So I'm going to place this back in. And there are, are a couple of little tags here, a couple of aqua colored tags that you can um, pull out, use to pull out that, that filter. So here is the second filter and this says do not wash on it. What did I do? Take a quick look here at the instructions. Ah, and also important for your safety, always turn off and unplug your air purifier before replacing filters. So, like any other electrical or electronic device, uh, that has electrical current running through it, you want to always uh, be cautious and be safe. Read the directions uh, before setting up and using the, the item. Okay, so let's use the second. Whoops. First, the air filter fell out. Here's the second. Okay, now this also says top front and it has the, the little tabs so you can easily remove the filter. Okay, so got the filters, the plastic, the filters removed from the plastic bags and let's see if I can. Okay, and that this back snaps off and on uh, quite easily. I've never... Sorry about that. So, on the top, there's a power button, a mode button, a fan speed, a timer, and a filter reset. I'm assuming the filter reset is when you put in a new filter. Okay, so let's plug this in.
Okay, I plugged it in. I heard a beep. Now, here is, there's some plastic over the LED or LCD. And, okay, let's go back to the instructions. Fan settings and the instructions, it's not an overwhelming instructional book. It looks like it's only a few pages. And uh, filter reset settings. After replacing either filter, press and hold the filter reset button for three seconds. So there's the, here's the filter reset button. Here's the power button. So let's turn that on. Oh. Now it is on. There's a lot of air coming out of here. And I'm going to press the fan speed low, medium, high. That's the high fan. It's fairly loud. There's the low. The low is quite quiet. And One of the really neat features of this air purifier is this LCD, which gives you a readout of the air quality. It's able to detect how much debris, pollen, and smoke is in the air. So again, there's the power button, the mode button, the fan speed, the timer, and the filter reset. So, seems like a fairly straightforward setup. And just want to show you the back of this. Well, I wanted to give you the the model number, but the model number is uh, the Bissell 400. So here it shows you the the air quality and so 2 is considered good 165 is moderate and 457 is is poor air quality so I don't know if you noticed this but initially when I first turned the unit on the air quality was 008 and now the air quality uh, is well, it was 006, uh, so I don't know how often that uh, reads the air quality. I'm going to turn it off, turn it back on. Okay. So I just pressed the power button, turn it off. Now I turned it on, and it's doing the reading the air quality. 111, 007, oh, that's a good sign. 007, double, uh, 006, 006. So, now it's at 006. So, that is the setup of the Bissell 400. And uh, there are more features that I'm not going to get into right now. I will tell you a little about why I purchased this. I have a very bad reaction to smoke, any type of smoke, uh, cigarette smoke, uh, smoke from something burning in the kitchen, marijuana smoke. I cannot stand the smell of cigarette smoke or marijuana smoke. Now, I don't want to go off on a political tangent. I, I have a lot of friends and family who have at one time in their life dabbled uh, with pot. I never have. Uh, I was a classical musician most of my life, and uh, 
that requires a really to to be able to perform in classical music and memorize music. It it requires uh, a very very sharp and thorough memorization of notes. So I it was not something I was ever interested in. Uh, however, I'm just going on this tangent because I I don't judge people. If, if they want to dabble in sort of that sort of thing, I'm not going to judge them or think poorly of them. Uh, I, but, so what happened was, the reason I'm buying this, or the reason I bought this was because recently, uh, in my apartment, there's been smoke. And I'm not sure why that is. Uh, smoke is very, is able to penetrate through fabric and walls and through circulatory systems, heating systems, air conditioning systems. So I've been waking up with a sore throat uh, and I've been noticing there's a lot of smoke in my apartment. So uh, I'm not quite sure where the smoke is coming from. That's really the topic for another video. However, to quote from the Big Lebowski, uh, this aggression will not stand, and of course that's a famous President Bush quote, uh, I can't have smoke in my apartment. So, and when you have smoke and you're sleeping and there's smoke in your apartment, you inhale it, you inhale a lot of it. And with all that's gone on health-wise in the past three years across the country, I think it's good to have clean air whenever whenever possible. So, oh, and now it's at 004. So I don't know if just within the region of the air purifier, it's purifying the air. I don't know if that's the reading for the whole room. So, uh, so yeah, I bought this because there's there's been a lot of smoke in my apartment. And uh, that uh, is not acceptable for healthy living. So... I, uh, I have this and I'm hoping that it is going to solve my problem. I do plan on doing a second video on the performance of this and I'm, uh, the two rooms, the bathroom, which is for some strange reason is very smoky, and my bedroom, which is also very, has been very smoky, uh, I'm going to test this in those two rooms and get a reading of what the smoke level is and uh, see what the performance is, is like. So I want to do a second video at some point talking about the performance and perhaps I'll also feature some more of the features uh, that this unit has. And just a quick thank you to my wonderful sister who for my birthday, my 56th birthday, which was November 10th, she gave me a $100 gift card. So that goes a long way on Amazon. I am an Amazon Prime subscriber. And after a lot of deliberation, uh, there are a lot of things you can buy. I mean, so many things that are available on Amazon. Uh, I, 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 I settled on this. And again, I paid $31 and change out of pocket. And the grand total was $172 and change. Uh, now, I don't know if you've noticed the, the reading is 004. So it started at 008, and now it is at 004. So I don't know, it, again, if that is for the whole room or just the, the area right around the unit. So I, I hope you enjoyed this video this review and again it's not a comprehensive review and again I'm not ex an expert in air quality I'm not an expert in air purifiers uh, I'm just a, a amateur consumer and I, I hope you enjoyed the video thank you so much for watching take care talk soon